check and make sure. Nope, I don't need to. I can see it from here. Perfect. Welcome in, everyone. Let me get my iPad. To those of you that might be joining on YouTube, welcome in. Please come join us on the WhatNot app in order to be able to bid on any of the items that I'm going to show you. So I'm streaming from my porch today. I had hoped maybe I would be able to make this a storage show, but we haven't quite fallen back into a routine yet where I can commit to storage days. So uh, you'll get to enjoy the, the green background and keep an eye out in the back. You never know, the coyote might make an appearance. So welcome in everyone, welcome in. I'm gonna start with some baby boy sizes, only about 10 little outfits. And then after the baby boy sizes, then I'm going to go ahead and do some bigger boy and I even have tween. It's just a little bit of a porch cleanup uh, because everything is in bins, but it's still not as organized as I need it to be. I, I quick threw everything into bins when that um, hurricane of the century was headed our way and thankfully here in Los Angeles um, we did not get hit too bad it was uh, Palm Springs and Las Vegas I think that got hit the worst so welcome in everyone and I see that there's a question in the chat so let me quick I like to pull it up on my iPad it's much easier for me to see my aging eyes Oh, what's the starting bid? It just depends. So um, the outfits, because they're two pieces, those are going to be starting bid of $10. The separates are going to be mostly starting bid of $5. I have some nicer pre-loved items that are also going to have starting bids of $5. And then at the end, I always try to do dollar starts as well. So it's a little all over the place, depending on um, what what I might show first. Okay, so thank you so much for joining. If you haven't already, please bookmark I do have um, one pair of boys leather shoes that I'm going to start at a dollar. So definitely click the bell uh, to be notified when I do that. I'm doing uh, boys and girls. It's mostly girls uh, leather shoe show on Wednesday at 10 a.m. So definitely go and bookmark if you haven't already. And I will be doing a buyer's appreciation giveaway. I have some cute little puzzles. You can choose from one of those puzzles. So I like to put little reminders in the auction. If you just click the bell next to it, then you can be reminded when I start the dollar starts or the buyer's appreciation giveaway or those leather shoes. But for now, we're gonna start with some baby boy new with tag sets. And I quick did the math um, and Moms that are just now finding out the gender of their babies to be, um, that they would have gotten pregnant sometime around um, Memorial Day, and they're at that 15, 16 week mark. And uh, so they their babies are due in February, which means that if you buy something three to six months summer, that would be good for February babies, February, March babies. So just kind of keeping that in mind because a lot of the stuff that I have is summer items since we were a boutique at the beach, uh, but I do have uh, fall winter as well. So the first, the first set is actually a fall winter set that I put together. It's a super cute pair of little pull-on pants that are nice and soft fleece on the inside. Has this really cool neon stripe that kind of shows through. These retailed for $29.95. And then the Glow in the Dark t-shirt retailed for $25.95. So that math is almost $60. Here's a cute long sleeve Glow in the Dark. And the two of them are both three to six months winter. Three to six months winter winter fall winter okay and i'm going to go ahead and start that auction at ten dollars for the pair okay ten dollars for the pair cute little pair of pants that are nice and fleecy on the inside and then adorable little shirt also glow in the dark has the snaps on the side three to six months winter so for babies that are summer babies they'll be in three to six months winter ten dollars start sixty dollar outfit 80% off. The next little outfit that I have is more of a summer outfit. Okay, so this one is six to 12 months. So again, this would be more so for babies uh, that are going to be born, I guess, in February. So if you're just now finding out that you were um, that you are pregnant and you're like 10 to 12 weeks, I guess, and you do the test, then that would be the 6 to 12 month size or little tiny ones that were 
preemies that aren't going to be in 12 months next summer. Otherwise, resellers, this is a great deal. These are cute little roll-up pants, 6 to 12 months. They retailed for $32. And then here's the matching shirt, cute little Henley. And then, of course, there's places like here in Los Angeles where we wear short sleeves year-round year-round wear for us okay so i do have that one in six to 12 months then these are so stinking cute this is the best deal of the day this one is 18 to 24 months and it's a little collegiate set by Appaman. so this is a sweater jogger pant little sweater knit and then here is the sweater knit cardigan so stinking cute again um even as separates they would probably sell well it retailed for 72 dollars, but we're going to go ahead and do a 10 dollars start this is 18 to 24 months 18 to 24 months the brand is appaman adorable little sweater set here is the 18 to 24 months cardigan here is the 18 to 24 months jogger pants those of you that are watching um, the replay on YouTube, any of these items that don't say sold down at the bottom, you can reach out to me and I can create a custom listing for you to purchase them on whatnot. All right. Like I said, for those that are still enjoying what's left of summer, I have this cute little pirate set. This is the pirate patch on the little guy there, contrast stitching. This is a three to six month set. We've got the navy blue shorts and the matching pirate tee. Doo -doo -doo. No, I'm not just doing baby boys today. I'm going to do bigger boy separates in a minute. I said I would do like 10 baby outfits for those moms that are wanting to shop baby still. And then we'll do some bigger boy in a few minutes here. All right. If there are any specific baby sizes that you want me to show, please let me know. Otherwise, let me show this one is adorable. This is from the brand four. Again, we're getting into fall and winter, 12 to 18 months, little boy corduroys, and they've got the nice stretchy waistband. Here is the matching handsome shirt, we call these. It's got the chambray collar detail, chambray pocket, chambray pocket, wooden buttons. This is from the brand four. And it's golf inspired where the set retailed for 60, but we're gonna go ahead and do a $10 start. $10 start, $60 set all the way down to $10. This is 12 to 18 months. And I do believe that I have this in other sizes as well. Rebecca, I see that you're saying three to six months. Are you looking for three to six months in long sleeves or short sleeves? Because I think I have both. I think I have both. Checking for my three to six month outfit. This one is actually 18 to 24. 12 to 18. Six to 12. I'm still digging Florida. So shorts. Okay. Let me show you this set because Splendid runs very small. Splendid runs very small. This is six to 12 months that fits a little bit closer to that six month size. It is definitely not a 12 month size. It's okay. Six to 12 months, but on the smaller side, this is a splendid set retailed for $42 doing a $10 start six to 12 months splendid set. And then I'll double check one more time to see if I have anything in three to six months. Right, got some cute t-shirts here that I'm going to do next in all sizes, baby and big boy. I see some long sleeve bamboo that I still have for baby. And nine to 12. So right now I'm striking out on three to six months. That doesn't mean that I don't have it in a separate bin. 
but I don't have it right here in front of me. So I'm going to move this one off to the side. Okay. That's all that I had for the sets. And then I'm going to show you some shirts that I have all the way up from 12 to 18, all the way up to 18 to 24. Okay, so we're going to do $5 starts. All of these are new with tags, boys, separates. Let me show you the first one. Okay, this is fun. Kind of, in my mind, you know, this can be any season. It is short sleeve, but it doesn't have the same, like, palm trees that some of my other shirts will have. It's got this funky graphic that is the cactus, the lizard. Lizard is holding the golf flag. Again, golf inspired wear. It does say four on the back. Has the contrast stitching here. Has a lot of stretch to it. So this is a 12 to 18 months. I have it all the way up to size eight, I believe. It retailed for $40 back in the day, but we are doing $5 starts today. Let me go ahead and drop it down to 15 seconds. That'll move things along. So starting with the 12 to 18 month size, I also have it in 18 to 24, and then all of the boys sizes two through eight. So if you'll let me know in the chat which size you might be interested in, all of them are going to start at just $5, new with tags, boys separates. Okay, so that's the 12 to 18. Looking for you to say run if you'd like me to run the 18 to 24. Otherwise, while we have people still popping in, I'm going to go ahead and run the size two. Running the size two, new with tags from the four collection. This retailed for $40. Cute front and back um, screen print tee. There's the lizard with the cactus and the golf flag. And then the cactus continues on the back. Really nice contrast stitching as well. And double checking. Let me know if you would like this t-shirt in size two I could run again. I also have it in size three. I no longer have the four, but I do have five, eight. Oh, and I even have a 10, 12. I do have a 10, 12. I do have this one in a 10-12. I'm not sure if my friend Candace is here, but I will save that for her unless somebody says run. All right. I will set those off to the side. Uh, a couple more that I'm going to show you that I only have in baby sizes. This one is actually Bamboo. Four was one of the companies that did Bamboo before Bamboo was a thing. So it's super stretchy in the t-shirt. Um, I'm not sure if the, the long sleeve part does not appear to be bamboo. It may or may not. See, yeah, 95% bamboo viscose. And uh, the cut on this is a little bit bigger. So this says size 12 to 18, but you can see that it runs much bigger than a traditional 12 to 18. It is more of an 18 to 24. Super cute screen print argyle there purposefully meant to look a little bit vintage or worn that is not cracking, that is purposeful, plain on the back, and wooden buttons like so many of the others starting this $50 long sleeve, 12 to 18 that fits more like an 18 to 24 or even a 2T in my opinion. Okay, you gotta eyeball it a little bit. Part of the reason I still have some of these is because they were missized. This is not a true 12 to 18, it fits more like a 24 months or maybe even a 2T, and it is 95% bamboo. It's bamboo from back before bamboo was bamboo. Another cute one, same thing. This one is not, um, this one is 18 to 24 months, and again, runs a little bit big, closer to the 24 months. It does have the four hit back there, and then it has the four here, so super stretchy, gray, and red, short sleeve, handsome shirt, and $36 was retail, dropping that price all the way down to $5. $5 start, 18 to 24 months, red and gray, runs a little bit big, super cute. That shirt, you know, can go more than one season. We do live here in 
California, so we love our palm tree prints year round. Not sure if you feel the same way, but if you do, I have lots of these left. It has the four um, hit logo hit on the back. It is a nice blue gray heather. Okay, it has a little contrast stitching here. And I have it in, like I said, 12 to 18 and 18 to 24. Looking in the chat for you to say run. Oh, it looks like I have two 18 to 24 months. And then let me go ahead and run the 2T first. And shout, I'll shout out the other sizes that I have as well. So this one, I have it obviously running in 2T, but I also have it in 4T size seven and size eight. Ooh, I think I might have to keep that eight. Tossing that one to the side. Okay, bigger boy sizes. Let me know if you'd like me to run that same shirt in any of those sizes. This is similar to the red one. I think the red one was crew neck. Nope, it was V-neck. So this is the same as the red and gray, but this time it's blue and gray. It says size 18 to 24 months. Has nice stretch to it. It is new with tags. It is from the four collection. Retailed for $36 back in the day. Fits a little bit big. Definitely closer to the 24 month size. All right, gonna go ahead and add that one. And then, Last call for baby sizes, guys. 12 to 18 months. This one also has bamboo. Let me see if they say what percentage. Feels like the sleeves. Actually, I take it back. So sorry. This one is 100% cotton, but it has the stretch and hand feel of the first shirt that I showed you. So this is a real, it must have something else besides just cotton. It must have some spandex. I don't know why it doesn't say that it does. It's got so much stretch to it. Anyway. Enough talking. Size 12 to 18 months. This is from the four collection. This one is nice because it doesn't have any of um, the golf four hits. Sometimes it's nice to just have a plain shirt from them. It does have um, down on the sleeve here, play golf, be good. But otherwise, there's no other insignia or logo. 12 to 18 runs a little bit big. Fits more like probably an 18 to 24. Oh, yes, Amax. So you have this one, right? It's so strong. Do you think that it's 100% cotton or that they mislabeled it? Hi, Diana. Welcome in. I think they must have mislabeled it. And then I have the same one. Um, No, mostly baby boy. I was showing mostly baby boy and I just was getting into a few of these four collection um shirts that I have. This one is 18 to 24 that fits more like a 2T and this one might be new without tags yeah it looks like it's new without tags sometimes the tags fall off new without tags thank you for sharing the live stream i appreciate that we talked about that this morning right that sharing the live stream helps so so much all right let's see so i'm going to drop the sets down there and then I'm going to grab some of the bigger boy pieces that I have. All right, I do have one pair of pajamas. This is a good reminder to me that I need to go grab the rest of those pajamas from the bottom of the stash and uh, try and bring them out. These are Skylar Luna. They're 100% organic cotton. They're very lanky in fit. So this is a size six. My little guy wears a size seven now and he probably could fit into these, honestly. 100% organic cotton. They really last well. I gave these to my niece, my niece and nephews, and they have traded them back and forth and worn them. We have them in red and green, and we've worn them forever, but yet they hold up super well. They come in this cute little pouch, okay? These are new without tags. Sometimes the tag just falls off of the pouch. I think they retailed in the 30s. 
So it's going to say baby boy sets, but it's actually a big boy set. It's size six pajamas. So AMAC, remind me, maybe even send me a little message that says reminder to check because I do have some cute ones for little girls. So to be able to almost match them, it's the same stripe in pink and purple. So yes, I, I definitely have red and green stripe. And then I have red and green star. I have a few snowman print, but then I have blue and purple and pink. I sold most of them um, this past winter that were pink, purple, and blue. I think I brought these home for Lucas and then forgot about them. That's why he's more in a size seven now. But I'm going to set them over there as my reminder to bring them. Okay. And then you guys can remind me. And as soon as I know where the Christmas ones are or the holiday. And the thing is about the red and the green, I, I love them because they are not Christmassy. Like they don't have um, Santa Claus on them or sleigh or reindeer. So you can wear red pajamas all the way up to through and past Christmas. We wear them year round. Same thing with the green. All right, let's do a few more boy pieces. Again, some of these are ones that I brought home for Luke that he didn't end up deciding that he likes or... We just have too many pieces, okay? So this is a size eight, size eight mini shotsu. Mini shotsu, size eight, super cute, new with tag. They're known for doing this fun kind of, um, what's it called, Trom trompole? I don't know how to pronounce it very well. $46 was retail on this one. Island Henley, that one is a size eight. And then a cute pair of Superism shorts. These are a size seven. Again, brought these home for my little guy and he decided he did not want or need these shorts. We just have so, so many. Size seven running for $5. Welcome in, welcome in everybody. Doing new with tags, boys merchandise. I have a few more pieces that I can show you and then we can jump into the pre-loved pile, which is a little bit more baby boy and toddler. Here's another size six, seven boy. It's this is handsome sky blue. It is from the brand Beiru and uh, made here in Los Angeles, retailed for $38 doing a $5 start. I know I love this color too. It's a nice kind of Sl uh, slate blue really cute and then i think i saw a 12 so this is a nice one for fall do i have anybody that's shopping size 12 so otherwise i'm going to toss this into the tween pile and i'm going to do a tween show teen preteen i guess we say for boys um let's see this one is also a size seven. No, of course. There is no need. Like, that's what I did. I brought home way too much. There aren't enough days. This is size seven. This is that superism. Um, many of you guys already have this in blue or green or brown. I also bought it in gray and white. It retailed for 28. I need to show this one to him again because it's so soft. He might actually like it. The seven runs big though. It fits more like an eight. Let me know if you want me to write <laughs> AMAC. <laughs> You're my biggest cheerleader. I appreciate it. Here it is in brown. Size seven brown. Fits more like a seven eight. These are so soft. They're so soft. Size seven brown. I think I'm going to need to start doing some bundles and or sized shows. I have enough size seven to do an entire show that is just boys size seven. Okay, you can see we bought, I brought this one home this past winter. You guys, this is an incredible sweater, cotton knit sweater. The brand is to be do. Okay, it's a size six. It is a true size six, six slash seven. Okay, but he's already in like seven slash eight. So he really would only, and we don't wear sweaters very much here in Los Angeles. So $52, this is 90% off guys, 90% off. There you go, guys. This is a great one. I'm glad that you guys are bidding on it because it is very much worth it. 
And so much of this stuff, if you take the time to photograph it, you can probably list it on some of the other platforms. I just can't keep up with it. Oh, wow. Thank you, guys. That's still 80% off. That's a great deal. Getting the bidding going there. Appreciate it so much. Okay. How about a basic white shirt? Thank you, Rusty. So this one, it says that it has a spot on it. Oh, it does. Okay, so I'm actually going to run this one in the dollar. I guess that's probably why I brought this one home. I was like, ah, oh, he can wear it, but then it didn't happen. So where's my dollar starts? Oh, there they are. I changed it a little bit. All right, so this is new with tags with a small spot on it. I have not tried to get it out. New with tags. It's a white t-shirt for a dollar. You guys know you can probably bleach pen it. Otherwise, you definitely could tie dye it. Size three runs big, super soft. If nothing else, layer it underneath things. AMAC, this is a great one. It's nice. White t-shirt just needs a little bit of love. A little bit of love. Okay. And let's see what else we have. This one is a 4T, okay? This is from that brand Nev Hawk. Nev Hawk does fun and funky. And so you see like the seam work is a little bit unique. It's got the seam running down the side and then a seam running down the back. Those are purposeful. It is gray burnout, but they're not as thin as the Joa Love tees. I do like that their burnout is a little bit thicker, just a touch thicker. And um, I think this tag, I don't know. I was going to say, I wondered if it was meant to be reversible, but I don't think so. Who knows? Like I said, they did some really fun and funky things. A lot of their stuff was. Oh, yeah. See, it says reversible. So there you go. A lot of times, that's a tip. A lot of times when the tag is made out of this super thin um, uh, thread, like this braided thread, it means that it's reversible. So yes, this one was reversible, $40 size four. It's unisex. It's definitely a little bit more boyish, but yet at the same time could be worn by a girl as well. Hey, Mac, I thought you might like this one. It's cute. Cute, cute, cute. Thank you for bidding it up a little bit, guys. Glad to get your bundle started. And I have, I have more of the Neb Hawk. You know, you guys know I have more of everything. Okay, I should do this, 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 this. These are all the seven eights. Oh, here's a nice, oh, this is a muscle tee. Does anybody want a size seven muscle tee? This one's big. This is much more like a seven eight. That one would be a $5 start. And that's Hunana baby size. Here is Bits Kid 8-9. Let me run this one next. I've lost track of where my stuff is. There we go. Okay, Bits Kid size 8-9. This one runs pretty true to size. It retailed for $27.95. It's got the nice charcoal heather here and then oatmeal heather there. Starting a pile of a couple of my bigger things for Candace. I'll tag her later. This one is size three from the brand Viera Rose. It's this really cute flannel that has some um, inset detail. So a little bit of a gray cotton there, woven cotton on the patch as well. Adds just a little bit more detail, extra button. Vera Rose, this one retailed for $54. We're doing 90% off. $5 start. Also cute if you wear it open with a little shirt underneath. Almost more like a little Western jacket. Really cute. The way it comes over the sleeves. Bit of a vintage wash. Soft. Emac and Rusty like the same styles and the same sizes. Rusty won that one. That one is number three. Okay, and let me go dig a little bit deeper. Let's see, these are 10, 12 pants. If anybody needs dress pants, these are from the four collection. Like these are really dressy, but they have the, um, I'm not even sure what you call this. Anybody know what that's called? 
in the back there where you can tighten them up. That's the old school way of, of tightening pants. Okay, going to grab some more, you guys. It's here on the porch. Okay, most of this is baby boy, it looks like. But I have more big boy over here. Thank you for waiting. It's warming up today. It's supposed to be a hot day today. All right. Odds and ends, guys. Help me clear the porch. Odds and ends. This one is uh, made out of terry cloth and it is Apple Man size 4T. It retailed for $40. We're going to do a $5 start. It does have little pockets here and it's almost like a crushed terry cloth. It's a little bit thicker knit than, let me try that run next button. There we go. Okay, boys separate. Size 4 has the little lightning patch. And it's a nice dark red and a little bit almost crushed. You can wear this either as like a cover up with swim trunks or as just a nice all around shirt. I mean, it can be seasonless. I think we should do more with that fabric. Okay, that one is number four. And next, I sold a ton of these, you guys. I must have brought home some size fours that I thought ran big. I don't know what I was thinking. I guess I thought I could squeeze him into this. It, he probably could, but he is bigger than I remember him to be when I'm looking at clothes sometimes. So this one is mini Shotsu size four. It does run a little bit big, but more like a four or five. And we're really in a seven now. So retailed for $48 back in the day. This is heavy. So it's big and heavy. It's got rock and roll on the front there with the guitar and the word rock. And then the back is attached. So you have this like bat like cape that is attached to the sleeves. It is not a detachable cape. It is actually in it. Oh my gosh. So cool, right? I had a bunch of these and I sold most of them. And for some reason I had a double of a four. So I thought maybe I could bring it home. Okay. Running this one, the size four fits like a four or five rock and roll mini shotsu tee, super cute, heavy, excellent quality. Mini shotsu is such a fun brand. Rusty's adding that to her bundle. That one is number five. Okay. Uh, I think unless somebody wants, I don't remember whether these were I think these are girl jeans, but if your son, like mine, doesn't mind a little bit more of what I call a rock and roll fit, I think I brought these home for him to try on. So unless somebody wants me to run them, we'll, we'll still try those on. That was a size eight. So it can be eight girls or boys. Not a skinny fit, but just a straight leg. Uh, this is size two. Size two retailed for $40. This is a great Appa Man um, Henley. And it's got the nice waffle knit on the sleeve, but then it's just a heather knit here. And there's the patch Appa Man logo hit. And um, yeah, 40. Size two runs a little bit big. Size two runs a little bit big, was $40. Do -do -do. Hey, Mac, you want me to run those jeans? Oh, no, you said never mind. Let me show them to you. And then if, if you want me to run them, I'm happy to. Let me see what they say. Yeah, they do say, they say girls' jeans. So they're girls' jeans that I'm I'm going to, I'm going to take the tag off it. He doesn't mind. He, I mean, he wears dresses sometimes for a dress up, but I just feel like these jeans, since he's tall and lean, they don't look like girls' jeans to me. They just look like jeans. You know, back in the day, when I would wear Lee jeans on the farm, like I don't remember them being in the boys section versus the girls section. We went to the farm, uh, the farm supply store, um, farm and fleet it was called. And we would just get, you know, new jeans. Maybe they were in the girls section. I'm talking too much. This is vintage Havana and I love these pants. 
I'm so sad that he can't wear these still, you guys. So this is Vintage Havana. It is a nice, thicker athletic wear. So these are similar to um, an Under Armour pant in that it does have the jogger fit here, but I just feel like it's a little bit thicker. More like the weight of a baseball pant, but with the styling of Vintage Havana. So Vintage Havana, they don't make boys stuff anymore. This is one of their last collections. The Poly Stretch Track Pants in a size four, they retailed for $40. We're gonna do a $5 start today on um, whatnot. Super cute, super cute racer stripe on both sides. I did, but don't think I still have the matching track jacket. It did exist though. These are great pants. I'm not a huge fan of Under Armour. All of my kids, all of, I should say, all of my customers' kids would come to the beach wearing it. It was before Lululemon became a big thing. And anyway, I just never fell in love with it. This is a nice weight jacket. And it retail, it's a size three. It retailed for $38. It's from the brand Mish Boys, and you know how Mish Boys is nice and soft. So it's a thicker jersey. It's a nice thick jersey and a kind of seasonless jacket. So obviously you can't wear this in the dead of winter, but otherwise I feel like it's all seasons. Nice zip up jacket, size three. It's a little bit big. Definitely looks more like a three, four guys, $38. Let's go ahead and run this one for $5. Oh, hi, Odd. I see that Odd is here now. I'm so sorry, guys. I don't purposely mean not to welcome you in. It's just so hard for me sometimes to see the names in the chat. Welcome in. Welcome in. This is such a great little jacket. I love the color. Nate, you know, it's not a dark navy. It's just kind of looks comfy, cozy. I mean, I would wear this. It's one of those things like the moms would always say, I want that in my size. And that is true. That is true. I want that one in my size. Have a couple. <laughs> We're going to go from shorts to snow pants, guys. This is just, it's an odds and ends show. I'm here on the porch enjoying this beautiful day. I am carless. I do not have a vehicle to drive me to storage. Um, we got to get it worked out to where I can commit to at least one, if not two days a week, where I go and do my old fashioned storage show. So in the meantime, we'll do a little of this and a little of that. I brought these home for him too, but he didn't wear them this summer. These are size four or five. They definitely fit a little bit closer to the five in my opinion. And I love that it's this kind of washed blue. It's a bright blue and the fading um, is purposeful because I think these were actually dip dyed. Oh, Mary, I'm in Los Angeles, but I'm close to the ocean. I am close to the ocean, Los Angeles County. Size four or five. $32.95. Yeah, all of the canyons here. We're fortunate because on the other side of us, it is very dry and brown, but we have this backyard canyon. We're in a condo building, so we share, you know, we share this backyard view with our neighbors, but it just happened to collect some of that extra rain that we had this past winter and really greened up nicely. These are eucalyptus trees, very common to Southern California, and they do hold their green. They hold their, their evergreen, one might say. Uh, $32.95 and size four or five in a really rich blue color. Pocket pull-on shorts. These are great for school. Um, kids are still wearing shorts for most of September, if not a little bit of October. Definitely here in California, if not in other places as well. Size four or five blue pull-on shorts. All right, we'll save those for... Another show, another day. Is anybody ready to think about corduroys? Gosh, it's so hard for me to start thinking about corduroys. But these are really fun, funky corduroys. Again, I feel like this is like a carpenter's waist or something. I'm not positive. It is slightly adjustable there. But like the... Um, like all the rest of the newer styles, it does have the adjustable waist on the inside. These are size six. They're from the four collection. They retailed for $40. They are a true size six, but they definitely have a little bit, I'm not sure if it's picking up. There you go. A little bit of vintage styling to them. The wash is a true navy. 
they are not washed out. They are a true navy. So size six, adjustable waist, true to size, navy corduroys from the Fork Collection. Super cute. Do, do, do. All right, we will save those as well. Remember, I, I still have snow pants, you guys. Also four or five. I, I swear I must have brought these home thinking that somehow he could wear them still, but there is no way. We are no longer a four or five. They do have a true jogger bottom. It is a nice, I call them snow because this is what we would wear. This is what Californians wear in the snow. They are not waterproof snow pants, but look, these are deliciously fleece lined. So these are great playground pants for when there's snow on the ground. Let's call them that, okay? Playground pants for when there's snow on the ground. They are a size four or five. They retailed for $49.95, but tonight we're running them for 90% off $5, size four or five. These are really great pants, you guys. I've sold, I have one pair of purple pants for girls somewhere still too. I think I have a couple more pairs for boys. Nice jogger bottom there. Keeps the cold out. Keeps the cold out. It does not get that. Why do I even have these? Like, because I grew up in Illinois and even banana bird. Thank you so much for getting your bundle started. Because I grew up in Illinois, I, I love a good, you know, winter pant, but it was a little bit crazy that I, uh, I bought as much winter stuff as I did for our beach boutique. It did get cold in our part of Florida, but not for long enough for people to invest in things. Uh, I do have a pair of size two niche boys pants. So these are the same color as that jacket. Unfortunately, it's not the same size, so I, I can't keep them together as a set. Uh, these retailed for $34, retailed for $34, and it is just a nice gray, um, no, navy heather, true jogger bottom, wit knit, almost as, as close to a legging as you can get for boys, as close to a legging as you can get for boys. I mean, I don't care if boys wear leggings. I'm just saying they don't market leggings for boys. I wish that they did. This is a knit pull-on jogger, size two, true to size, pocket on the back. Great daycare or around the house pants. Okay. And Odd. Odd got those. That one is number nine. All right. Let's see what else we have. This one is 12 to 18 months, you guys. I don't know if anybody's still shopping that size. I didn't see too much. Let me go ahead and run it. It runs a little bit big, a little bit big. 12 to 18 months jacket, new with tags, uh, retailed. Uh, the retail price is cut off because somebody must have gifted it, and then it came back to us. 12 to 18 months. This one is a little bit more spring, summer. Wait. Okay, we'll save that one with some of these other baby items. Okay. I don't think I showed these yet. These are Appaman size five. Appaman size five. New with tags. These retailed for $34. And it's yeah, still in good shape. Size five, pull on. These are their camp shorts. One of their really popular ones. They are frayed, but there's also the stitch there to keep them from fraying. Okay, so these are size five, retailed for 34, pull on shorts. And let me see. Yeah, faux drawstring, faux drawstring. Faux drawstring there. Right, going through the pile one more time. Most of this here is baby and baby. Got some handsome plaid pants, handsome pants. I have these in sizes six, eight, and 10. 
sizes six, eight, and ten. These are grandpa pants, you guys. So again, from the four collection, definitely golf inspired. They retailed for $54, so it'd be 90% off. They do have the uh, adjustable button, adjustable waist there, wood buttons on the back. I mean, yeah, these are golfers pants and they're not, but they're not scratchy. Okay. They're just a nice woven, not soft, not scratchy. Definitely an in-between like heavyweight. And there's a little bit of coolness on the inside. It's skulls is the print on the pocket. So six, eight, and 10 are the sizes that I have 90% off. No, no Ralph Lauren. The best place to get Ralph Lauren is in um, Favoli Styles shows. So she she gets some of those um, palettes that are from um, Macy's and Nordstrom, Bloomies, and they tend to have Ralph Lauren. Ralph Lauren is not as much of a boutique brand, meaning exclusive to small shops like the one that I used to have. Okay, uh, let's keep going. All right. Only because we have a couple more people that have popped in. Let me show a couple of these again. This one is 12 to 18 months bamboo, but it fits. You know how bamboo stretches so much? This one fits a little bit more, in my opinion, like a 24 months. It's nice and long. Nice and long. It is bamboo. It is screen printed. It's from the four collection. You can see that Argyle is golf inspired. $50 back in the day down to five really cute super stretchy i like this one a lot thank you a mac glad you got that one okay and there we go 10 separates that was the goal you guys i really only have odds and ends here at home but i wanted to try and sell 10 separates and then we can jump into some of the pre-love stuff that i have and uh some of it will be five some of it can be three some of it can be a dollar nothing more than five dollars um there are some things in the bins and i will accept any offer that anybody makes some of it is just like candy and toys left over from uh other shows that i've had there are a few things that are boy boutique brand items the prices are higher but i think you can offer up to 20 percent off i'm not sure um what not decides what the lowest offer is that you can have and whatever the lowest is that you can offer i will take okay so i will take all offers on items in the bin so feel free just know that once you make an offer that that offer is binding it's the same as purchasing it th at that price okay um, all right, so pretty love. Shout out your sizes for me in the chat so that I can dig for those sizes in this pre love stuff. In this pre love stuff. Oh, I forgot. I so I didn't do. I didn't do these yet. These are going to be in a future show. This one is the cow one. So cow mask and cow tail. But I did put the skunk ones. I think. I still have some of these from Dress Up that are so cute. Look at these skunk masks, boy or girl, and um, stretchy. So it can be, and, you know, it doesn't not have to be for Halloween, can just be for everyday play. These are from a brand called Opposite Afar. So I added those to the bin. Those are cute. I think I added them to the bin. Um, Just sorting things here, guys. Size 12. Size 5, 6. Okay. And trying to get to some of the pre love stuff. And I'll do a little bit of pre love girls, too, just because it's what's here. Okay, so pre-loved or thrifted. This one I thrifted, but it is new with tags. This one is a long sleeve crew t-shirt that is youth medium. So this one is going to fit like uh, a 910, I think. 910. 
AMAC wants me to dig for some 12 month girl. I will do that. Let me go ahead. Don't bid on this yet. Let me just, oh wait, no, not that one. Sorry. Ooh, and then I still have those shoes to do. I still have those shoes. And I do still have a few backpacks as well, if anybody is still shopping for backpacks. Sorry, staring at this. Hopefully you're enjoying the green background where, oh, there it is. It's right at the top. Silly me. Forgot I put that little thumbtack, brings it to the top. All right, so this one is new with tags. New with tags, it's from um, the North Park or the National Parks collection. Six and a half plastic bottles were used to create this shirt. It is Mount Zion. And this was a sample. This was a sample. Youth medium, 810, 910. Um, also, let's see. That one. Yeah, I don't, I just don't think, I bought this for my little guy, but I don't think we're going to need it or that he's going to wear it. He's got so many jackets, you guys. So this is Jimboree. It is size 7, 8. It's nice because it's the terry on the inside, but then it's more of a waxed cotton on the outside. So it is weather resistant. It might be, I don't think it's reversible. I don't think it's truly reversible, but it's just nice on the inside. All right, running this one, size seven, eight next. Seven, eight. I know the shoe show. I can't wait. I already loaded a few of the pedals um, and we're going to do $20 starts, which is outrageous because I was looking and some people are selling like torn up pedals for $25. Here is a pair of size five girls. I'm going to do the dollar start on these guys. They are T collection, but I cannot tell. Yeah, these do have, they do have paint here and a little bit of wear on the seat. But so these are just good, um, what you call it, daycare shorts. Okay, so these are play condition. You can see there's some paint there. Somebody enjoyed painting in these T collection. And so I will do a dollar start on these. <laughs> It's not sudden death just because that's one more step. Size five, T collection, play condition, dollar start. Let me go get those um, shoes that I want to show you guys because those will be a dollar start. Hopefully you'll bid them up a little bit for me. Okay. And where did I sit? Oh, put them on the, on the table over here. So on Wednesday, I'm going to do my first Livy and Luca show, um, and it's going to be most these um, suede petals. I have them in five colors. I have one pair of red left that I found so far, but I have multiple pairs of gray, marigold, violet, and aqua, and they all are suede there, but then they have the sparkle. These are a classic Matilda Jane pairing shoe, so many of the pictures that you see of Matilda Jane clothes. Um, the models are wearing Livy and Luca shoes. Okay, so this pair is going to be in the Wednesday show along with a bunch of others. Please bookmark and pre-bid. There will be some boy shoes in that show, not as many. Um, I'll have, I think I have about a half dozen pair now that are all new in box, all leather, Mostly see Chiron. I have more than that because I can see them right now. I've got four pairs of boots, one pair of baby shoes or little boy like um, walking shoes and then another. So there, yeah, a half dozen, I guess. Um, this pair is also see Chiron. OK, so when I carried see Chiron, they were not yet in Target. So these are the boutique brand see Chiron, which you can still find on their website and in smaller boutiques like mine. There is a lower end brand that they do at Target that is not these shoes. 
okay these are the nice full leather shoes and they have the best like seal um i don't know if it's the american podiatrist association or something but they've really worked to make sure that these shoes uh fit growing feet so this is the last pair of sandals that I have. I didn't even show them during sandal season. So if you can do the math and think ahead, these are size nine. It's a Euro size 25. It is the Jude in Navy. They did these season after season in Navy. Um, I had them in brown. I'm not sure if they've done them in black as well. They retailed for $48 size nine Navy shoes. And we are going to do a dollar start. I need everybody to bookmark my shoe show and please share it with a friend or two. If you're a boy mom, tell some of your girl mom friends. Okay, we're not doing sudden death. It just goes to the highest bidder. These shoes have really great resale value on um, Kitizen and Poshmark and some of the other sites as well. There's a great brand recognition with the Sekai Run brand when they are the all leather shoe. Very much worth it still, guys, at $8.00. Excellent investment. Candace is here. Candace, I set aside a few um, 8s, 10s, and 12s for you. Thank you. Candace got her bundle going. These are great shoes. So glad. Okay, so I'm just going to write shoes on them. They don't have a number. So I'm not going to do dollar starts on the others, guys, but I will occasionally, especially with some of the summer ones, toss them into my shows here and there to help build up the uh, excitement for my shoe show. We're going to try and do it here at the pool and try and drag the shoes down there. Um, they're not that heavy. Uh, let me... <laughs> no, that's okay. I, I purposely tossed a few things off to the side because um, there were not that many people that um, were shopping the bigger sizes. So I will show you a little bit of that. Um, I have one more dollar start here that I think you guys might like because I know I've got some moms of girls as well. Um, I was looking at some of the things that have been here on the porch and this one was sitting on top of the pile and do, do, do. Oh, it's just barely there. I don't know if it's a little rusting from a hanger or just some smudge that'll come out with a bleach pen, but I am going to do a dollar start on this is, it was new without tags. I still have a bunch of these in the bin, both the superhero ones. They're the sequins that flip. Um, and there's a matching blanket somewhere too. I've sold these a few times, but this one does have a small stain on it. That may or may not come out. I haven't even tried. I literally found it right before the show. And I was like, oh, somebody maybe has had their eye on this. It's the Mermaid's Imagine pillowcase. We have these blankets. All right. No, not a problem. Not a problem. Let me show you guys a couple of the backpacks before I delete that. And these I still have bunches. I know most of you guys already got your backpacks, but there are a few people that still don't go back to school until after Labor Day or that decided, you know what, I think he does need a new backpack. They're um, called the Vintage Style because they um, fit a 13-inch laptop inside. They have this front pocket. Um, the nice thing is that these are made from the same brand as the Herschel backpack, so it's a good quality. They're Parkland. So there's the pocket there. This one is a marine print. I have both boy prints and girl prints. So let me run the marine print and then I'll double check the chat and see they retailed for $40. So half price. I went to Target. I could not believe how expensive Jan Sports are. They're called the vintage style. That's what I was going to say because they're similar to that classic Jan Sport. Any sneakers from Sekai Run? Katie, I have not come across sneakers yet, but I am going back to storage tomorrow and I will grab one more box of mostly leather shoes, but I'll look and see. I think I do have a couple pairs. Rusty, yay, thank you. This is a great backpack. I love that print. Okay, so that one was backpack number one. Okay, and then... Let me do it like this, okay? Let me show you two, and then you can get buyer's choice. That way I don't have to run them all at the same time, okay? So you could choose either the gray one, or you could choose this kind of almost tie-dye print. 
If you are also interested in a backpack, $40 retail. This is called their Swell Print. And then this one is a charcoal and gray called their Skyline Print. To do, oh, a little of this and that. Pre-loved. Thank you. I appreciate that. Yeah, ship. Uh, Rusty, once you get to that certain number of pounds, you might as well do um, free shipping. I will show those two again. Thank you for pointing out to me that when I went to run next, it didn't run next. So let me show you two more. This time I'll show you two girls' colors. And you guys just let me know. I don't want to spend the whole show showing backpacks, but I have so many of them still. They're so expensive otherwise. So you could either get the purple one or you could get the dot one. Whichever you like. These are great backpacks. $40 retail, $20 today on whatnot. They're Parkland backpacks, same um, manufacturer as the Herschel brand. All right, Rusty, which one would you like? Would you like the, uh, what's it called? Scuba Abyss Dots? Oh, do you want me to do a little bit of a, like a bundle for you? And then uh, this one is Starfish. Yeah. Okay, so here, let me... How many do you need? Do, do, do. I have the two girls and the two boys. You want to get all four? Okay, so let me run one more bundle of three then. And I have more in storage too. Okay, let me do. So you've purchased two. And so let me change it real quick. Let me see if the, if we're talking the same language here. Okay, this would be if you wanted the other three that I showed you. If you wanted three backpacks for $52, then you are welcome to them. If not, perfect. Yay. Happy to make that deal. Yay. Thank you, Rusty. Awesome. Awesome. Okay. That is all the backpacks that I brought down. Thank you for selling. Claps, everybody. Do the clapping emoji for selling me out of the backpacks that I brought down. Excellent. Excellent. All right. Remove that from live show. And then... Oh, I am going to do the buyer's appreciation giveaway too. Let me see what else I have that's pre-loved. Um, I know Amax said she wanted to see 12 to 18 months. So let me see what else I have over here. I have a Hannah Anderson. I have a Matilda Jane. And then I have a couple things that Candace might like. All right. So this one is... Matilda Jane paint by numbers. This will be a $5 start. Trying to find the size, guys. Size 12. This is a size 12 um, blouse, I guess. Sleeveless blouse. It gathers. It's generous fit, but it does have the ties. Okay, so you can tie the back and it bubbles at the bottom. It's pretty cute. I thrifted this one. I. It's hard for me to turn down Matilda Jane whenever I see it, so... This one is pre-loved, size 12, in pretty good condition. I would say definitely GUC, if not EUC. There's a tiny bit of wash wear on the brown here, tiny bit. Yes, I'm going to show a little bit more size 8 boys. Kate, I did a lot of 8 boys, but I have one other person that might be interested in it as well. So just helping a few of my friends that um, have bundles going to uh, get a few more pieces to round out their bundles. So let's see, that was this and that, number one. Okay. And then uh, I have this cute Hannah Anderson piece that I wanted to show you guys too. And you guys know better than I do. It's the size 90. So what is that? A size three, size three, it's 90. It looks like a size three to me. See, I'm pretty good at it. I'm pretty good at eyeballing it. I never memorized them. I need to. I need to. 
give myself a quiz. So this one is fleece, Hannah Anderson. It does have signs of wash wear the way that a fleece normally would, but otherwise I feel like it's in really good shape. It's got that cute contrast zipper. Rusty's going to take that one as well. Okay, and then uh, this one is a little first impressions. I'll drop this one down to a dollar start. Uh, cute little first impressions. It's got all those colors in it. It's a sweater knit dress, and I feel like it uh, would match with just about any legging or jegging. I just thought this one was cute. Okay, I thrifted this one. I think this one was a bins pull. I feel like the sweater knit is still in such great shape, and even the bow, you see how it still lays flat. It is first impressions, but soft and sweet. Rusty's going to add that one. Okay. And then let me show some of those size eight boys again. Okay. Let me show some of, thank you, Rusty. Your otter reminds me, there's a famous otter here. Have you seen the news? So she goes by a number, 641, I think, and she steals surfboards. So she's been really... <laughs> She's been really sneaky. The aquarium has been trying to catch her. I think it's the Monterey Bay Aquarium. They've been trying to catch her so that they can just do a well check. They're planned to re-release her, but at the same time, she's been getting so close to people and stealing, <laughs> literally stealing their surfboards to play with um, when they're out like paddle boarding or swimming back. Um, and so there's a couple of local photographers, um, it's up in Santa Cruz, so it's not local to Los Angeles, but she is the cutest, spunkiest thing that you ever did see. So, um, let me see what else I have that I could do. Dollar and sudden death. Ignore this, you guys. I'm just going to run this for a second. Uh, in case anybody else was looking for dollar starts, just ignore that for a second and let me dig real quick. And see, I thought I had a big pile of, aha, I do. There it is. Okay, I just have a couple of these like random pieces mostly baby girls. This one is three to six months. One of those cute little tutus. And oh, I did it for five seconds. How about that? And let me see. I put all that boy stuff on top of it. I'm having a hard time grabbing it. Okay, two more girls dollar starts and then I'm going right back to boys, guys. Going right back to boys. This is 2T Oshkosh. Cute little, uh, what do you call that? Like shibori print. And it's a fully lined skirt. Thrifted this one. Too, too cute. Okay, switching it back to 15 seconds. These are just a couple dollar starts that I had set off to the side here little Oshkosh skirt if anybody wants to add size 2T to their bundle. Dollar start. I know it says sudden death. I keep forgetting to turn it on. Oh, that's what it was. Let me try this again. I think this was a set, you guys. It's a little Harry Potter set. I was like, why did I grab that? Yes, it's a set, you guys. It's a little bit better deal now. So here's this cute little size three to six month skirt goes with this cute little three to six month future Hogwarts student. It does have wash wear. That's why I am doing a dollar start. No major stains. Thrifted guys, dollar start set three to six months. Three to six months. I thought it was cute for that Harry Potter fan. And then we're going back to size 8, 9, 10, 12 boys. If you're just tuning in, we're about to jump back. Last one before we do 8, 10, 12. New with tags, boys. This is Zara, size 10, you guys. This is Zara, size 10. I think I bought this from somebody on Whatnot. I don't even remember. It's cute. This is a nice, very mature sweater. 
very mature size 10. It's cute. Running it for a dollar, guys, if anybody wants to add one more thing to their bundle. Rusty, I think this is a good add. This is really cute. I just have too much stuff, so I don't mind throwing a few things at you guys for a dollar to help round out your bundles. Okay, Rusty grabbed that one. All right, and... This is just going to be titled More Boys. It's going to be new with tags, $5 starts. Oh, I'm terrible at typing. I have my iPad off to the side there. Is anybody else terrible at typing on their phone like I am? I just, I can't seem to get better at it. I am so much more of a... Um, typist than a texter. All right. So auction, the category is, well, it's giving me a lot of random categories. Can we find kids? There we go. Thank you for your patience. I'll do 10 more pieces at $5. Okay. If anybody wants them and then we'll do a buyer's giveaway. Okay. So I'm going to do 10 more pieces, sizes 8, 10, 12, at $5 starts, and then I will do the buyer's appreciation giveaway. So I moved them over here on top of those dollar starts. Let me show one more time. I'm gonna start with the size 10 of these pants, okay? A couple people didn't see them. We're gonna run these for $5, okay? They do have the adjustable waist. They do have this funky skull print on the outside, on the inside. Otherwise, it is a handsome plaid pant it is golf inspired wear, adjustable waist. Candace, I had you in mind for these long and lean, really cute. Has that interesting um, zipper pocket right there. Perfect. I thought you might like those. Now, let me just double check that you want the size 10. I also have them in 8 and 12 if by chance you wanted to go up or down. I think 10 is perfect for you, but just offering before... When we move on. Yep. Perfect. That's what I was thinking. Does anybody else want to see them in the eight or the 12 that is the more number one. I think I had one other mom that was saying size eight. So let me show you the eights. Okay. Size eight running now. Size eight running now, adjustable waist, really fun skull print on the inside on the pockets. <gasps> no, it's a size six, you guys. Rusty, I'm sorry, I thought these were eights. You can cancel that. Oh no, here's the eight. All right, Rusty, I'm so sorry. I thought I had eight, 10, and 12, but what I had was six, eight, and 10. So just tell me which one. You want the eights first? Doo -doo -doo. I think she, you want both. Okay, so let me go ahead and click run next. Of course, it won't let me. Okay, running that one next then. So two, more two, and more three. I am going to try and do um, just a kind of laid back show tonight that is Amazon returns. I used to all last year. Um, when I was still trying to figure out what to do with my inventory, I sold things on Amazon. It's harder to sell uh, clothes new with tags from past seasons on Amazon. So that's why I'm doing whatnot now and will continue to. I much prefer it over selling on Amazon. But many of the things that I was selling have started to come back to me if they've sat on the shelves too long. And it's a hot mess of stuff. It's everything from beauty products. And I, by beauty, I don't mean makeup. I mean, like shampoos and body washes, and then there's spices and soups. There's pet treats and advent calendars. It is all over the place. Anything that I either had at my old store or that I purposely sourced here in Los Angeles to sell on Amazon last year. So if you're interested in any of those things, it's just kind of a fun um, chit chat show that I'm going to do this evening. Let me show a couple more of these size 8, 10, 12s. Here is one more pair of handsome pants. These are, they say a size 10, 12. They are the longer. These are much more of a size. Well, 
I take it back. You know, they are more of an 11. They split the difference, okay? Let me see. I think they are longer than the first pair of size 10s. One season, they didn't. They went all the way up to size 12. Then the next season, they just started labeling one size, size 10, 12. Yeah, so these are these are shorter. This makes no sense at all. These are actually shorter than the 10s. So it says 10, 12 on them, but they're a tiny bit shorter than the other 10s. So Candace, if you're interested in another pair of size 10s, these are also four. And they have this funky back pinch in detail, but at the same time, they do have the traditional um, adjustable waist. They retailed for $56. So at $5, you're getting them 90% off. I'm so glad that you came in. I almost tagged you, but instead I was just setting off to the side and I was going to do a separate big boys show, but this is perfect. This way you can grab them and... I can pack them up and they'll be off my porch. This one is size 8-9, guys. This is from the brand Bits Kids, size 8-9. And it is both oatmeal and charcoal. Oatmeal and charcoal. So here is the charcoal here. There is the oatmeal and size 8-9. It runs nice and long. has a tiny little flaggish detail there. Speaking of flags, I can't wait to show you guys. Um, every September nearby at Pepperdine, they do a huge display of flags. It's mostly American flags, but it's one flag for every person that um, perished on September 11th. It's a beautiful display and it's right near um, Pepper. It's part of Pepperdine University's campus and um, I'm reminded that they're about to set it up because they put tiny little landscaping flags in, you know, to space them out is just, it is a powerful, powerful reminder um, to me whenever I pass by it and any, anybody else, you know, to be thankful for what we have and how quickly things can turn. Um, but I, I'm going to show you guys because it's one thing to see it in photographs and I'm, I'm just hopeful that you guys can experience you know, the moment, the same way that I get to when I drive by it. Kind of chokes me up a little bit. All right, Appa Man size 12. And this one is a really soft, I'm sure it's a poly blend. So on the inside, it's just a regular, almost feels like a knit. Let me see if I can, there you go. So there's the inner knit, but on the outside, it's like that polyester fleece that has an even softer. Yes, polyester rayon spandex. And this is a generous size 12. If anybody is ready to start looking at size 12. It's a trim fit 12. It retailed for $50. $5 start, you guys. $5 start. I only have a couple left and then we'll do that buyer's appreciation giveaway. Do, do, do. Rusty's going to add this to, I'm going to need a big box for you, Rusty. I don't mind. I don't mind. It's a good excuse to use up my boxes i do have one more this is a little bit smaller i do have one more of these nev hawk tees this one is a five six i think amac you might have gotten the four five right i don't remember which size you got amac if you're still here this one is the size five six retailed for forty dollars i still have one And then I'm going to look real quick to see if there's any more 8, 10s, or 12s. Okay, this is that reversible burnout t-shirt from Nev Hawk. Um, oh, this one. This is this one. This one is 8. Let's see. This one is size 8. This is a trim 8, guys. Oh, Rusty, you grabbed that. Okay, let me make sure I get it before I... Get. Do, do, do. That one is more seven. Okay. This one I showed earlier, um, and it's the Viera Rose, but this time in the size eight. So it's a nice um, 
smooth flannel here, but then it's a little bit of a vintage wash on this gray woven that is both the pocket and then uh, underneath the collar there, the shoulder. So I'm going to run this one size eight, and I would say this one is a trim fit eight. Trim fit size eight flannel from Vera Rose boutique brand designed in Brooklyn and it retailed for 54 back in the day. Let that one run down. I will drop the price on this one. You guys, again, just helping you guys out with your bundle. If anybody would like this one for $3, Otherwise, I will save this one. I like this one for my little guy. It's just, it's going to be a while before he gets into it. It's a National Parks t-shirt. It is Zion and it is a sample. This was a sample and I don't know this brand. I mean, this is a t-shirt brand, I think, but made out of six and a half water bottles, which is really cool. Christy's adding that. Gonna sneeze. Oh, excuse me. Sorry. Out here on the porch. Happens sometimes. All right, um, what else do we have? Oh, one more pair of pants. These are 12s. These are 12. So you know what, Candice, how about you remind me, try the two pairs that you have, and then know that I have one more pair, unless you really want to go ahead and give them a try. If anybody wants me to run these, I'll run them for five. But otherwise I would suggest just reminding me, I have these, they're $54 pants, size 12. It's a nice herringbone, but it does have that same um, interesting adjustable waist like on the sides, but it also has the traditional adjustable waist there. Okay, so let me know later if you guys want me to run those. Um, and... Hmm. Uh, this one, guys. Does anybody want some 2T rags? I would run this one for five. It's pre-loved. I think I bought this from somebody on Whatnot just to support their show. I have no one for it. Yeah. Here you go. Kate says, yes, I'll buy that. It's cute. It's, I'm not a rag seller. My friend Krista is. I don't know that I bought this one from her, though. I think I bought it from somebody else. It does have a hint of washware, just a hint of regular washware, but otherwise in pretty good condition. And that's why we're... Oh, Rusty jumped in there. $6, and that one goes to Rusty. I really... Sometimes I buy things thinking, oh, I'll put it in the bin. And it just doesn't happen. So I'm glad to add that to your bundle. Um, let's see, where are those other? Okay, guys, for those of you that weren't here at the beginning, let me show this one more time. Okay, and I have it in a few other sizes. So this is from the brand four. Here's the logo hit on the back. It is this funky t-shirt that has the stripes, the cactus the lizard and he's got the golf flag in his mouth and then the cactus continues on the back and it's super stretchy okay a nice thick stretchy t-shirt and retail on this was forty dollars this is the size 10 12. careful down there the coyote was here yet um, this morning, right here, like right yeah. where you are. Yeah, that one is great. Yes. Rusty's going to grab the 1012. And that one was number 10 of 10. Let me go ahead and grab the buyer's appreciation puzzles. If anybody else wants that shirt, I can add the listing back. All right, so, uh, so silly. Right. this is just the reminder in case anybody 
So here's what I'm doing now, guys. You'll see I'm running down um, a five second reminder auction. And that's just a way of saying, oh, hey, I know you bought something. If you want to come back and enter the buyer's giveaway, you can. And the way that you would be notified is if you click the bell on the buyer's appreciation giveaway listing. So I'm not sure if anybody actually did click that bell or not. But if they did, they just received a notification. And I'll double check. No offers right now, but if you wanted to make an offer, please feel free. Otherwise, you're going to get to choose from one of these two, okay? So this one is Beautiful Birds. This one is Endangered Animals. Now, these are thrifted puzzles, and normally, you know, I shy away from, but it looks like mom took the time to put all of the pieces into a Ziploc bag, and so this puzzle was either put together once or given up before they even started. I mean, there's no wear to the box at all. So I hope and think that uh, you guys are going to get all pieces and you can decide. Puzzles, puzzles. Yes, Trista? Are you just saying hi or did you have a question? Were you, um, were you trying to catch my attention? Maybe just saying hi, hi, hello. All right. Um, if there is anything else that, <laughs> okay, I appreciate that. <laughs> Hi. Let me go ahead and quick draw a winner here. And then you can choose your puzzle to add to your bundle. Yay, Candace, which one would you guys like to try? Nice 200 piece puzzle. These are supposed to be, they're so pretty. I love the Crocodile Creek brand. I used to sell this brand in my store. There it is. That's the better picture. Which one would you like? Birds or endangered animals? I like these myself. I just don't have enough uh, cleared off spaces to be able to put puzzles together. Do, 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 endangered. You got it. You got it. All right, guys. I think I'm going to call it a day on this show. That was a nice hour and a half. Sometimes, you know, two hours is my sweet spot, but um, it uh, it's a little bit crowded here on the porch. So I'll take the next half hour to put try and put things back together before my next porch show. Um, I'm going to go ahead and click end the show instead of a raid just because I am, I'm having, there's a glare. I'm having a little trouble seeing the, the chat. So thank you everyone. I love you guys so much. And if you want to have some fun and just kind of sip a glass of wine and see what I used to sell on Amazon, I'll go live one more time tonight. Okay. Take care everybody. Bye.